Hello friends, welcome to the video series on SQL PL SQL interview questions for Oracle developers. So in this video, we'll see about a very simple question called what is dual table in Oracle. Though the question is very simple, this is being asked most of the for most of the uh, freshers or beginners. Sometimes this question is being asked for intermediate level of expertise also. However, then you need to explain this table with lot of examples. Okay, in this uh, video, we'll see what should be your answer for a beginner and intermediate level of expertise. To start with, Dual is a very simple dummy table which is created as part of Oracle installation and this table will be available in a schema called Sys and this table has only one column called dummy and the data type of this column is varchar2 of 1. This table will have contain, will contain only one value called x. So this, this should be your answer if you are a fresher and this table is can be used for evaluating some expressions or to just to compute some expressions or to select information from user defined function. So this should be your answer if you are a beginner or a fresher. However, if you are a bit experienced person, then you should explain with more uh, with lot of examples. Okay, we'll see with few examples. To start with, when you say select star from dual, as I mentioned, it, it will have a column called dummy and it will just print a value called x. You can in fact go and describe this table which will, it will just show the data type of this dummy column. So we'll start seeing, uh, we'll start uh, seeing some examples now. So the main use case of this dual table is in, especially in Oracle, when we write a select statement, the minimum class to write the select statement is a select and from. You cannot write a select statement with only select class. It has to end with a from class. So, but in some cases like this kind of example where you want to compute just one plus two. In this case, you don't have to actually retrieve information from any table. So just to complete the syntax of the select statement, you can use this dual table. So this is a very simple use case. And in fact, the, uh, these kind of use cases for these kind of use cases only will be using the dual table. So here is another use case. We are I'm just computing the simple interest. So PNR by 100. So to compute these type of information, you don't have to select from any other table. You can just select from dual table and just the computed results will be printed. So here is another use case. I'm using I'm using the dual table to find the square root of 100. Okay. So you are using the SQRT function. So here's another use case. You can say select user from dual or you say select sysdate from dual. So all the uh, user defined functions or inbuilt functions can be called from the select statement with dual table as far as this particular function is returning single scalar value so here is another use case i'm using the substring function just to print the first two character from the dual table so in all these examples if you see we are actually not selecting any information from the table this table is just used to complete the syntax of our uh, select statement there can be another question from this uh, point. Can I use any other table other than a dual table? In fact, can can someone create their own table very similar to the dual table? Yes, user can create their own table which can have only one column, one row in that. That will behave very similar to this dual table. However, a dual table is optimized for performance. So it's better to use the dual table. And one more thing is that th this table doesn't need any permission for any other users. It will be available for all the users. We'll see with few more example. So here is another use case like where I'm using the dual table to get the uh, sequence related pseudo column like next val and carval information. So this is typically used in the PLSQL also. So one more very use case in a PLSQL is uh, in PLSQL, we cannot use a decode directly in the expression. When you try to use a decode directly in the expression, you will get an error saying that decode may be used only inside the SQL statement. To avoid this, we will be using the decode as part of the dual table. So like th this, is, this is the real use case. You will be using the dual table to execute your decode statement in PLSQL, something like this. We will see one more use case. So as you can see here, I am using the dual table to print the fifth multiplication table. It's not just only from dual table. In fact, I'm using the Ronan pseudo column. I'm using the connect by class, all these things. But the key learning here is that you don't have to select this information from any table because we are in fact not expecting any data from any table. Just to complete our select statement syntax, I'm just using the dual table. So let's see one more example. So here is another use case. Typically, these kind of questions will be again asked for a fresher level. How can you print a string in a pyramid structure? Something like this. So you can use the dual table along with the Ronan pseudo column, along with substring functionality using the connect by classes. If you want any questions to be answered, you can share your questions in the comment section or you can drop your questions to this mail ID. 
I have compiled all these questions in this blog link which is given in the description. If you have learned something new in this video, please like it, subscribe and stay tuned for new feature videos, interview questions, concept videos, tips and tricks. Thanks so much for watching.